Hey guys, it's your girl Jenny June. How are you doing today? We're going to be trying on and showing you unboxing what I got from Dia. Dia & Co. Dia. It's a clothing service box. Um, it is for sizes 14 and up. So if you start at a size 14 and up, you can definitely get your own box. They will charge you $25 for a styling fee if you keep anything out of your box. They will apply that $25 credit towards the cost of the item. If you keep all five items, you will get a 30% discount, I believe. Let me find my paperwork on that and just make sure. No, it is a 25% discount if you keep all five items. So very similar to Stitch Fix. And I'm sorry, the styling fee for Dia is only $20. So $20 styling fee, all five items are 25% off discount. Um, you do get a styling note from your stylist. Uh, kind of saying the pieces, why she picked them out. And you can also on Dia select the items that you want to go into your box. And I selected, I think, a couple of pieces and let them select the rest. And whatever you don't want, you just put this little envelope and it goes right back through Priority Mail through USPS. And um, you can call for a pickup for that or do a pickup online or sometimes I can squeeze it in my mailbox. Alright guys, so let's dive in. I'll show you the items that I got. We'll talk about pricing and the branding and all of that. And then I will do the try on portion for you. So I did ask for one thing. I didn't really ask for it. I just saw it in there and selected it. So I selected a couple of pieces. Um, like I was saying earlier, but the first thing I selected was just your basic black hoodie. I know you can probably get these at Walmart and Target and places like that, but they're kind of getting expensive on their hoodies. So I saw this one in there and I really liked it and I thought hopefully it'd be really nice quality. And um, this one is from Mark, New York. It is the Amanda French Terry hoodie in black and it's $69. Um, but it is your basic hoodie. It's got your zipper, your hood in the back, and then your little kangaroo pouch there in the front. Uh, it does feel nice. Feels like it's very nice um, quality. So we'll definitely be trying that on. And then the other piece that I did select was this. It looked a lot darker um, on the computer screen. This is by Social Light Curve. <clears throat> And it is the Caitlin Diagonal Color Block Top. It says olive green and pink. And it, again, it looked a lot darker on the screen. But this thing is $49 and it is so soft. And usually I don't go for things that are this light. But the gray in there, even though it keeps saying olive green, I just, I don't know. I don't see it, guys. To me, it's gray. It's gray on screen. It's gray without me looking in the camera lens. This is gray. I don't know where they're getting olive green from. I, I just don't know. But anyway, <laughs> it is super soft. It looks nice and casual to wear around the house, um, to wear out on, out on errands as we transition into the fall and winter months. And then I think I did pick one more item out. I did three out of five. I got some leggings. This is by Premise. Premise Woman is the brand. They're the Laura Pull On Point Leggings in Black, and they're only $39. I got this really awesome pair. I think the brand was Hue um, from Stitch Fix, maybe at the beginning of spring or the end of spring, something like that. And I was hoping that these would be like those. These are a lot thicker. Um, I'm trying to remember if these are even full length or if they're capris. I think these are full length, but these are very thick thick and heavy which for me in a legging I don't like I like to go a little bit lighter on the material because I have a tendency to get hot a little easier but I will try these on they may be something I really like once I get them on the fit might be really really good but they are again just your basic black leggings now the other two pieces I just asked for some tops so let's see what she sent my stylist this time was Abby and I think Abby's new for me to have all right, this is by the brand Downing Studio, and this is the Angela Mock, Mock Neck Taint in Mauve, and it retails for $32. I've never had a Mock Neck Tank before. This thing looks really tiny. Um, it's like this pinkish shade with a little bit of gray, blackish looking colors in there. It's got some really droopy side arms, I will say that. 
It's not just because the tag is there, because the side looks the same way. Kind of droopy. Um, very, very soft, but this looks extremely short too. I have a longer torso, and sometimes these short, short tops just don't look good on me, but we'll try this on. It's super soft. I, I don't know the reasoning behind this. Because typically I don't like sleeveless tops, even though I have one on today. Um, because I don't usually wear them out of the house. <clears throat> Unless it's to a zoo or some type of activity that's really hot and I just have to be a little bit cooler. Alright, the next thing is from Mary Sky. This is the Deborah Short Sleeve Waffle Knit Top in Black. And it is $29. And, um... I don't like the knitting. The texture on this is not my thing. It's very sheer. As you can see and this looks really wide very big it's just your short sleeve v-neck shirt and it oh god i hate these ties at the bottom these knots it's just not my style this one thank goodness is not in the center it is more off to the side but i think all this does is add i mean this is something that's noticeable when you're wearing a shirt so if you're like very slim and i mean if you want to wear this plus size curvy girls go for it for me I don't I don't like wearing it um, it it just draws attention to my midsection and that is not where I want anybody's eyes to be I, I'd rather I'm up here or at my legs and my feet or something but not that midsection um, so this just draws attention because it's different and it's something that your eyes would kind of gravitate towards so I don't know that I'm gonna like this but of course I will be trying everything on for you Alright guys, so that's the five items I got. The total is $218. If I keep all five items, I get that 25% discount. I did pay a $20 styling fee, so I'd also get that credited back. Um, the total in my box was $143.50 if I keep everything with that discount and they take off my $20 styling fee. Alright, so not a bad price for the box, but I can already tell there's probably at least minimum of two pieces that are not me so unless they knock my socks off when I try them on um, I probably won't be getting them but you never know that's why I do like these boxes you just never know what's gonna happen all right so let's get to the try on portion all right guys I have on this mock neck tank it's $32 by the brand Downing Studio I again it's just this isn't something I would normally wear it is very soft um, I did have the suspicions that it would be short, and it is a little short, and it does have these droopy, <laughs> droopy sides. Sorry for the noise in the background. I do have a child, so, you know. But I just, I don't like this thing. It's not my style. All right, so I did want to go ahead and add on this black hoodie with this little mock shirt, if you will. The zipper is getting stuck, so I'm not even able to get this zipped up. And for $69, that zipper better work smooth for a hoodie. I can't. I can't even do it. I've been sitting here trying off camera for a good few minutes. Um, even this feels a little short for what I would like for a hoodie. The leaves, the leaves, the sleeves, the length of the sleeves um, is perfect. And again, it's got your little hood back here. Um, again, I just can't get the, can't get the zipper to work and that's just not okay for a $69 piece. <sighs> yeah, I just can't get, I couldn't get it off camera either. All right, so both of these pieces are going to be going back. All right, the next thing I have on is the, um, this little shirt, which is really soft, um, from Social Light Curve. This is a Caitlin Diagonal Color Block Top. Retails for $49, olive green and pink, but again, this is great. I mean, this may have a hue. I, I don't know. Anyway, um, I love this. It's super soft. It's very, very comfortable. It's just too big. Um, I can't even see my arm, my hands. It's so long, and it is very, very big. So I'm going to see if they can size this down for me. But it's really soft. I really, really like it. And if I lose any more weight, it's going to be like really too big. And then what's the point? So we'll see if they have a different size. All right, guys, I have on the black shirt. This is from 
Mary Skies, the Deborah, Deborah short sleeve waffle knit top, and they sent me a 3X on this, which I'm new, normally a 2X, 1X, 2X, which I don't even know why they sent that, but it's $29. I don't like the print of this. I talked about earlier how sheer it is, and um, I mean, it's soft and comfy, but it's just, it's way too, way too big, and again, guys, I hate these little ties on there. So it's just too big. And then I also have on the leggings, the black leggings that retail for $39. These are really thick. Um, so these would be great if you're outside doing that kind of thing. Um, they're really comfortable though. So this could be something I might keep if I can't get that soft shirt that I just had on um, with the camo on the top. If I can't get that in a 1X, then I will end up keeping these because I spent $20 on a styling fee. And I do like these. They fit. And I would wear them. They're just not my preference. But I'll make them work. You can always wear black leggings with something. So, um, And they're kind of, they're a little bit dressier. They're a dressy legging, if that makes any sense. But again, this top, too big. I don't know why I got a 3X. Um, and it's just not my style with this crazy little thing here. All right, guys. So that was the try on, um, this mock is going back. This hoodie is going back. I, I tried and tried to get it zipped. I'm going to see if they have a one X in this cause it's really big. This is going back. I still have on the leggings. I told you my plan for the leggings and for this. All right, guys, let me know what you thought, um, about the items I got. Uh, leave me a comment below. If you're not already subscribed, welcome. Thank you for being here. Go ahead and subscribe now. We'd love to have you. Check out some of my other um, clothing try-ons and um, some hauls and unboxings. And thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. Everybody, like the video on your way out. It's very simple. Just click the like button. And it helps me out a whole lot with this whole YouTube algorithm business. And uh, I appreciate it. Stay safe. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye.